Oregon is unmatched in the diversity of its agricultural and environmental landscape. From rugged coastlines through lush valleys across high deserts, and the College of Agricultural Sciences at Oregon State University is out there, connecting scientific discoveries to communities and industries that rely on those insights. In addition to dozens of research labs and institutes on campus, the college has 14 agricultural experiment stations located across the state. This statewide system of research stations has a rich history. It began in 1887 when President Grover Cleveland signed the Hatch Act, which provided annual funds for agricultural research stations at land-grant colleges in each state and territory. The first Oregon Agricultural Experiment Station was built in 1888, and since then the system has grown into 14 stations strategically located around the state to support industry and address environmental issues within each region. Together, a network of over 400 scientists in 28 academic disciplines strive to improve quality of life, environmental sustainability, and economic development in rural and urban communities across Oregon and beyond. These stations are the engine of science working every day to make tomorrow better. Of those 14 experiment stations, the North Willamette Research and Extension Center, known as NREC, is the most agriculturally diverse. NREC is located on 160 acres in Aurora, Oregon, just 20 miles from downtown Portland and one mile south of the city's urban growth boundary. It is the only agricultural research center serving the Willamette Valley in the heart of Oregon's most productive farming region. NREC serves this hotspot of agriculture and natural resources through research and outreach that supports a range of industries. From Christmas trees and nursery plants to berries, tree fruits, and specialty seed crops. Nearly 40% of the entire $5.7 billion farm gate value of Oregon agriculture is produced within a 50 mile radius of the station. NREC's unique geographic location and proximity to Portland makes it a critical interface between urban and rural communities. NREC bridges the urban-rural divide by helping the public better understand where and how their food is grown. NREC is home to 35 faculty and staff and supports a wide variety of research and education for the farming community. Agriculture is Oregon's largest industry. One in 12 Oregonians are employed in agriculture. With 75 field trials and 50 more projects in labs and greenhouses, NREC research is organized into nine programmatic areas. Oregon's world-renowned berry industry adds over $140 million to local economies and is growing at such a tremendous rate that there are more job openings in berry production than there are graduates to fill them. Oregon is the number one producer of Christmas trees in the nation and has been for over 40 years, growing 45,000 acres at a value of over $120 million. Oregon's nursery industry is among the top three production states in the nation and was Oregon's first billion dollar farm gate crop. NREC research covers everything from plant nutrition and health to pest management, irrigation efficiency, and energy management. Oregon grows 99% of U.S. hazelnuts, and OSU Research is well known for having saved the hazelnut industry from Eastern Filbert blight, which first threatened to destroy the crop more than 30 years ago. The Orchard Crops Program at NREC focuses on hazelnut production and also research that supports growers of fruit trees in the Willamette Valley, including the burgeoning apple cider industry. The Metro Small Farms Extension Program at NREC aims to improve the economic and environmental sustainability of small-scale farming operations. NREC is home to Oregon's Specialty Crops Registration Program, part of a network of field research centers that cooperate with the National IR4 Program. This program provides growers pest control options to ensure a stable food supply and maintain a healthy environment while ensuring the success and profitability of farming operations. The Vegetable and Specialty Seed Crops Program at NREC addresses the needs of vegetable growers in the Willamette Valley, as well as specialty vegetable and flower crop seed growers. The Willamette Valley is one of few places in the U.S. and the world that produces most of the vegetable and flower seed used by farmers and homeowners. The Willamette Valley is the largest producer of grass seed in the world, and the Field Crops Program supports growers of grass seed, as well as growers of clover and wheat. 
In the summer of 2019, NREC was the host location for the grand opening of OSU's Global Hemp Innovation Center. NREC is one of several station locations in Oregon, pioneering research for the industrial hemp industry. The newly formed Organic Extension Program began in 2019 and provides a greater emphasis on the organic production of fruits, vegetables, and livestock. In addition to these research programs, most NREC faculty have appointments with the OSU Extension Service and share their cutting-edge research through outreach education programs by offering field days, workshops, and teaching classes that bring the latest scientific information and technologies to our communities and industries. Other services at NREC include the popular Tractor Safety and Certification course, which delivers hands-on farm equipment training to ages 14 through 17 the Beef Plant Health Scouting Program, which uses aerial drone technology to assess the health of plants from the air, and OSU's Bee Friendly Pollinator Program, which helps farmers improve the habitat for pollinators. NREC's Bilingual Education Program offers plant health workshops to the nursery industry and develops food safety materials to growers and the Spanish-speaking community. These research and outreach programs at NREC serve Willamette Valley growers and the people of Oregon with science-based information that supports vital agricultural industries, addresses environmental issues, and enhances the quality of life for all Oregonians. The Oregon Agricultural Experiment Stations advance our collective understanding of the balance between production and conservation, and continuously strive to make tomorrow better.